everybody always think it's like about celebrities, but it's more so about me making everybody that sit in my church feel like a celebrity, feel like a superstar, look like a superstar. What's up everyone? I'm Sierra LaFay. Welcome to my channel. So I had the opportunity last week to go to a very nice salon in the South Loop of Chicago called the Superstar Experience and I got a sew in so I wanted to show you guys my trip there. So with this clip I was just letting you guys know that I parked a couple of blocks away. There is meter parking right in front of the salon but I was just being a cheapskate and decided to just get the free parking and walk over. But, um, I mean, meter parking isn't expensive at all. And as you walk into the salon, it is extremely peaceful. It's very nice. And the stylist Courtney really helps to make you feel like you are a celebrity for the day. So what I already did was wash and condition my hair at home. I actually did a steam treatment on myself and I used the Oilplex products. And right now Courtney is just separating my leave out from the rest of my hair that he's gonna braid up. And I was able to ask him some of the heat train hair questions that you guys had asked me. So make sure you check out my latest video to see the answers to some of those questions. And I will say with this process, he was super quick. And this braiding pattern was just like amazing. It reminded me so much of Beyonce's braiding pattern, but I feel like this is the best braiding pattern to get your hair as flat as possible under a wig or a sew-in. Never had my hair braided in that pattern. And then he went ahead and oiled my scalp. I'll link the product down below. It's by Care Care. And then he went ahead and sewed a cap straight to my hair so that way the weave would be sewn in onto the cap itself as opposed to being sewn on my hair to help prevent with adding tension to my hair. And what he did, which I never had a stylist do before with hair, was he wet the weave um, and then he started to sew it in and he said, by wetting the weave, um, it makes it easier to sew the weave onto the net. And then he also double wefts the weave as he's sewing it onto the net. So that way you're getting really, really nice full hair with it. He did this process really quick too. I felt like I was in and out pretty quickly. And then I sat under the dryer for a few just to let the weave dry. And then he's gonna go in section by section straightening the hair. This is the flat iron he used. If I can find it, I'll leave it linked down below. It's the HD Pro flat iron. And I did ask him about his tips for frizzing. And he let me know that for the most part, it's just really hard to avoid frizzing when you have natural hair. So what he does for a lot of his clients is actually use a relaxer. And this particular relaxer is a very natural one. It doesn't relax your hair, making it super straight, but you still can have that volume and that natural flow that your hair usually has with it being natural, but it just helps to tame the hair a little bit better. So I'm actually not anti-relaxer. I'm simply pro do whatever is best for your hair and make Making it easier for your lifestyle but I know people who are kind of tired of being natural and are trying to transition into heat training hair but may find that it's still just like not working for them this particular relaxer may be something you may want to look into but these are the final results of my hair I was obsessed I still am obsessed I'm going to be keeping in this so in for a long time. Let me know what you guys think in the comment section below. I will have all of Courtney and the salon's information in the description box below as well. And until the next video.
I want to thank me for doing all this hard work.